So, hiya folks, um, not sure when I'll put this one out, uh, it might go out before Christmas, might go out uh, after Christmas, um, but I'm, uh, yeah, I'll, I'm going to join a little bit on, you'll probably get sick, sick of the sight of me over the next three weeks uh, while we're away, ready to leave frosty old blighty uh, for a few weeks, uh, which is all good, so probably like most people, not much happening uh, pond wise, flip your quick look so put the uh got a bit bogged up in here at the moment because of next year but put the inline heater on got that set at about 13 12 13 degrees um pond is we've got a bit of carpet wrapped around it as well it's up to about seven degrees at the moment so that's all right um fish are looking really well can't really see them at the moment but they're uh they're doing really well so uh, yeah nice and easy to fit the clover leaf straight into the box filter there and straight into the pond as i say it's, it's about seven degrees fish are looking really well on it so i'll uh, i'll probably notch it down to sort of 10 uh, and hopefully it'll hold it'll hold around about sort of 10 degrees and um, there's some really good plans for this next year some great advice as well off people thank you very much indeed for that about not ramping the temperature up too quickly and making sure it's uh, everything's nice and steady away um, work out the costs probably going to be about three pound a day um, to run the clover leaf so that's not the end of the world uh, I don't smoke so there you go it's, uh, that'll do for me that's my justification I don't smoke and I don't play golf <laughs> um, so yeah some big plans for in there definitely going to put a bottom um, definitely going to put a bottom drain in there um, and we'll, we'll see how all of that goes um, so we will snap back all right folks uh if this goes out before christmas um then have a great one if it goes out after christmas i hope you had a great one all right take care gang speak to you soon okay folks i uh, was hoping to get some fish in but apparently it's illegal in uh, australia to keep going carp so i'll uh, i'll find something to add that might be a bit fishy but for now i just thought i'd give you the view from sunny mornington down on the south coast, south of the Bay of Melbourne. Absolutely stunning. Absolutely beautiful place. I'll flip you around and we can have a, a quick look. You can see this is Cashin in the background. There you go. Absolutely stunning. It's a concert going in the park behind us, going on in the park behind us. Beautiful. So um, yeah, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to you all. Uh, I think I put that on the bit. I'll edit onto the front of it, but, uh, but there you go. You can have it twice. Uh, so hopefully there'll be some uh, fishy stuff going on. Um, but otherwise, that's about it for today. All right, folks, take care. I don't know whether you guys can see how clear that water is. Absolutely crystal. It is beautiful. Hiya folks, so uh, we managed to get a little bit of uh, fish into some of the vlogging. A uh, very nice lady originally from Cornwall, owns the Aquatic Vault uh, in Rosebud, not far from Sorrento, uh, down at the south, real south end of Australia, um, just down from Melbourne. And she's allowed me to uh, to do a little bit of filming around, uh, some nice bonsai trees in the, in the background there. So um, it's all uh, tropical, uh, tropical fish, so we'll have a look at a few of the aquariums. Um, yeah, carp are illegal in Victoria and the fine is $5,000 for keeping carp. Um, apparently it does go on behind closed doors as with anything. So uh, Pablo, you'd be uh, in your element down here with the contraband carp. 
Um, so uh, yeah, I'll flip you around and we'll uh, we'll have a quick look at some of the tanks. I have no idea what some of these fish are, but there's some absolute stud. Just have a little wander around. There you go. The bonsais are uh, pretty cool. Some nice Japanese maples there, look. The light's not particularly great. Sure, some of you guys will, uh, will know what most of these are, what a lot of these are. So, you can buy goldfish. Goldfish are fine. Big fella, isn't it? Merry Christmas. <laughs> Hiya, gang. Uh, definitely not fish related one, this. It's just a, a nice day out on Boxing Day to visit the uh, War Memorial uh, in Melbourne it really is something to behold so spin you around uh, and you can have a quick look Fantastic avenue up there. All the cypress trees are dedicated to different battalions uh, and regiments. Absolutely superb. So I'll get up and a little bit closer to it. Take a little bit more footage. Well, what a place! You can very atmospheric. This should do, eh, guys? Imagine that as a back garden. see signs up saying watch out for the turtles <laughs> off laying their eggs 
Absolutely stunning.